Hi everyone, this is Sarah Fezio, and today I am going to do a pour with summer colors. I have fresh tangerines, that is Glidden Diamonds. I have Laser Lemon, which is Bare Premium Plus Ultra. I have Light Green by Artist Loft, Light Blue by Artist Loft, and I'm trying a red product. Now, this has not, this is Bare Premium Plus, but it's high gloss enamel and it comes in red. So it's kind of like the white I use. It just comes that way. They don't actually add any pigment to it. So it's like a red base. So I'm only going to use five colors. I'm not going to coat the canvas first and I've done nothing but thin these two down with water and added a little bit of water in the other ones. Now, since I'm not going to coat the canvas first, I want to use a lot of paint, but I wanted to use more than my standard cup, so I'm going to use a plastic cup. And I'm going to start, as usual, by layering the artist paint with the house paint. So I'm going to add some light blue on the bottom. Then I'm going to add some of my yellow. I'm going to add some red on top of that. And let's add some orange. I don't think the house paints will mix together because there's different brands and different um, finishes actually. Now let's add some green. This may look great, or it may look kind of, you know, we'll see. All right, so we'll add some more yellow. I only have two artist colors, so artist loft colors. I'm gonna add some more yellow. Hopefully you can see that, I think so. Let's go with some orange. If you've seen any of my other videos, you know how much I love fresh tangerines. Um, green. It's almost all the green. Red. Blue. The red may take over in this, I'm not sure. And yellow, whatever's left in there. And the last of my orange, which I'll just plop straight down the middle. Okay, so in the past, some people will, I know some people will do a crisscross in their cup. I didn't do that, but the last time, last two monochromatic paintings I did turned out really well. So I'm just going to tilt the cup and then tilt it back down. And I think what I'll do is I'll just kind of spritz it with some water. I'm using a 12 by 12 inch gallery wrapped canvas. And on the corners here, I'll just kind of put some green paint. That siren was here, not at your house, FYI. Okay, so let's see what we get. Hmm. 
Interesting. I do have cells in there. Good job of pouring or tilting today. Okay, come on. not at this point it's really not moving very much so what I'm gonna do is take this cup that take this stand move it and grab another one so that I don't have it sitting in a whole bunch of paint There's all these orange cells right in here. There's a little bit of blue, green, and it kind of feeds into the orange, which is nice. It was a little bit messier than I anticipated. Okay. But it does appear to be completely covered, which is good. It was almost not enough paint. If you have to work that hard to get your canvas covered, you almost don't have enough paint on there. Just FYI. Okay. I'm going to adjust the lighting so you can see better. Hold on. Can you see all these orange cells in here? there. So I have this really nice green, blue down here, but there's blue with red, with orange, with yellow and green right here in this one little cell. These are nice little orange cells over here. And again, this was just paint and water. So let me, um, give me a minute to wash my hands and I will take the camera down. Okay, so I'm trying to make it focus up close. Oh look, I move it a little bit, the color totally shifts. I'm gonna put my finger there, maybe it'll focus on my finger. Okay, so it's not all one color. The orange is creating lots of nice cells. So very interesting painting. Almost you could have just done the orange and the red together. There's some blue over here, green, orange. Very interesting. This is supposed to be a painting with red, orange, yellow, green, and blue. I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is Summer Colors. And remember, if you have any questions, I'll answer them as soon as I can. Just put them below in the comments. 
uh, questions and comments down there. Also, make sure you give me a thumbs up, share this with your friends, and remember to hit the gray bell and subscribe so that you can see more of my videos. I want to wish everyone a good evening. Thanks for watching. Lots of love. Bye.